Hello and welcome to another game which many many people class as a classic. Yes, this is Brothers in Arms which was created by Ubisoft maybe 10-15 years ago now and there are actually three games in this series which I may cover depending on how the first one is received and whether you guys want to see some more. I'm going to be playing this game with quite a bit of respect really just because of the subject matter so don't expect me to be pissing around and joking around I want to play this in a way that feels right and that's the way I want to play this game now I am actually running quite a few mods here if we come down to chapters and down to mutators I'm going to be running these mods here um, which add quite a lot to it we're going to add the soundtrack the proper gravity we're going to be adding real traces Gonna be adding, uh, that's not quite working correctly at the minute. We're going to be adding the German smoke. Uh, we're going to be adding um, the command hints. This gives us the opportunity to try different things and adds more things to the game. We're going to be adding the Hollywood effects, which gives us more dirt and dust. Uh, we can add. I'm not quite sure that this is actually working, so I'm not going to put that one on for now. I'm going to put the command mod basic on. Let's see if there's anything else in here that we want to add. Real tank shells, we shall add that as well. I think that's everything for now. Body count, let's add that as well. And I think that will do for now. That will do for now. Unfortunately, I can't turn the volume down, this is preset. But let's jump into the first part of Brothers in Arms. And that will be taking part eight days after the drop into Normandy with Sergeant Baker regains consciousness at Hill 30. A change man, and he is prepared to die. Let's jump in. See you on the other side. My dad said something to me after the divorce. He said every soldier has two families. Those you raise, and those you raise hell with. I've spent eight days here. Eight days commanding a squad I wasn't ready to lead. Eight days watching my men, my family, kill, be killed. Eight days wishing it would stop. Baker! You okay, Baker? Get him out of the street! Jesus. Shaking so much, it is actually physically realistic that you would be shaking with adrenaline running. That's why I can't actually hold the sight still. Go. Shift the enemies over to the side as well. Shit, we've got armor. Shit! Get down, get down! Fuck! Man. 
quite a powerful introduction for a game that's really quite old, quite intense really. Quite looking forward to doing this series and I probably will do as I mentioned the other two games in the series. If that's what people want to see and they're interested in me playing this then I will continue the series. I noticed many of the buttons are quite strange, his middle mouse buttons went down the site and things are a little bit strange to to what work we're kind of really used to. Another story follows the uh, Marines, US Airborne, Paratroopers, Baker Company and I think the story intertwines quite a lot. I'm told that the story can be really quite in-depth and interesting as we learn through the three games throughout the series. There are flashbacks to other characters and things that happened in the previous games, so I really am quite looking forward to this. I did play this originally on the, I think it was the Xbox, it could have even been the Xbox One, and I remember back then I really enjoyed the series, so hopefully, along with Full Spectrum Warrior, which is another game I'm enjoying the playthrough at the minute, it will return to the old days when games had more of a story and less of the action base, whereas now it seems to be action with a story bolted on. So I'll shut up, I hope you enjoy the series as much as I do. All my respect. first part as a little bit of a teaser in to, in to introduce the series so thanks for watching thumbs up subscribe please do comment it would be amazing if I could get to two and a half thousand subscribers or even three that would be legendary I know we don't always do these things to make money or a career out of YouTube but I do enjoy doing these videos and I hope you do watching them alongside me as I play so I shall see you in the next video in this series coming real soon thanks for watching I've been Paraplays. Dismissed.